All right, can't wait to bring some more democracy to the galaxy here. Uh, so I've, uh, I, I, you know, I've gathered a few regular viewers now of Helldivers. And I thought to myself, you know, the recent videos I've done are sort of, uh, you know, kind of like hodgepodge of me doing this, me doing that. I'm not really, you know, I'm just trying some things out. Uh, there was that one with the, the voice activation, activating, uh, stratagem thing. I'm still, I'm still trying to figure that out if I should actually do that or not. So I don't have that running, uh, quite yet. I'm really considering, uh, doing it though. And, uh, but I thought I would, uh, maybe do kind of like a rundown uh, of sort of where I'm sitting at right now. So if we go to the armory, I mean, there's, there's so much coming to the game. Uh, they're adding to the game so fast and making changes so fast there's no way i can keep up but that's okay because they they're doing something that uh you know that when i heard they were doing this i 100 percent supported it uh when you when you go to these uh, war bonds here they're never going away right so you got all the time in the world to unlock them um because they're i guess they're coming out with another one really soon i mean when this video comes out it might already be out <laughs> i don't know there's so many oh i did get this one so I did unlock it. I did get enough points uh, to do that. Uh, but, oh, there, there's just so much to unlock. I'm on page seven. What is there, 10 pages? And it just gets more medals as they go. Uh, so anyways, this is basically how far. I've collected all the way up to page six. I'm working on page seven. I just grabbed the stamina booster. Uh, I'm not getting the equipment yet. This is, uh, this is a really popular outfit because uh, it's like one of the really stealthy ones. And it's not like super great though, is it? No, because it's got that radar scan thing that's not super, super important. Um, but anyways, I'm, I like trying all the equipment and everything like that and seeing what I can do. So there's this one. Now, I don't think this one's very popular. So it's the Liberator uh, Penetrator. Uh, so reduce damage, reduce... Uh, ammo capacity, increased recoil, and it doesn't have a full auto mode. I mean, but it can penetrate medium armor, which is really good. Uh, but, so I'm using this one right now just to try and get a handle of it. I mean, it, it's certainly not a super great one. It, it's not good for hordes of enemies, of course. Uh, and I'm not using the heavy armor at the moment. I am doing a lot of solo stealth stuff. I do see the, the appeal to that. Uh, why people really like the solo the solo part of it like the solo stealth uh part two so i'm doing that i am getting better at it sort of i mean they made the that update not too long ago and the game got a little harder so i'm trying to think of what i'm i'm gonna do this episode if i'm gonna do a difficulty three or four yeah it's four that is that used to be the good balance for me uh to do it but now i'm like looking at like medium difficulty which is just number three um, but we'll see. But then there's the whole thing about what is, you know, what is sort of the goal if you're like a solo player. Now, I do a lot of uh, uh, pickup groups, like random randoms, and I do that on difficulty 7. So I'm, I'm no stranger to the harder difficulties. Uh, most of my uh, random matchmaking were successful in difficulty 7. So, I, I you know, I can hold my own in it. Uh, I'm getting that figured out, collecting samples and stuff like that. But when it comes to solo, there's so many missions that give you trouble. Um, I don't feel like I've conquered a difficulty unless I can handle all the missions in that difficulty. So I think I'm, I think I'm still like, I'm back to medium where I used to be four. I want, I want to be on four. I have to figure out the defend missions, but you also need, uh, like a, a good amount, like everything to choose from. Uh, then there's that side of things where I'm trying to practice with all the different stratagems. And there's so much to the game. Uh, and then I, I then I go on YouTube to try and sort it out and learn <laughs> and watch things. And oh, I mean the demographic for Helldivers is completely different. <laughs> like the demographic for my channel and uh, you know that sort of thing. It's it's I get some Helldivers to the channel checking it out. And I mean it's a very niche channel how I do things here a very uh, simplistic way uh, but it's um, yeah it's just different when I go out and look at the different channels to try and learn I almost feel like I'm watching Fortnite videos <laughs> and some it's not Fortnite it's not that bad of course 
But I mean, oh, everybody, everybody's so young playing the game and they're in their uh, mid 20s or whatever like that. And they take the game so seriously and they put so many hours into it. And, uh, you know, it's their job. Uh, <laughs> and I, I know it is, but I mean, it, it, anyways, so, so seriously. And the complaints, I, I can't get over the complaints. They're just wild. I'm like, there's no way. There's no way the developers intended so many people to be soloing that hell dive difficulty just the same way over and over again. Anyways, I, I won't get into it, but they're just so upset that they can't solo um, the hell dive difficulty now. And I'm, I'm like listening to that. I'm like, oh my goodness, just it, it's probably not designed that way. <laughs> I know, I'm sure some can do it, but anyways, that's kind of the goal, like the solo uh, player kind of thing. It's just to see how high of a difficulty you can get. But that's just where I'm sitting. I'm sort of looking at medium because even medium gives me difficulty now because they've upped the difficulty, it would seem. You know, the meteor showers and everything uh, in those defense missions. But I might just be doing medium again because I really have to keep practicing because I'm, you know, I'm... Anyways, this is how I see the game. I'm just, like, doing it as challenging myself, playing with all the cool stuff, seeing what comes out, you know, even if this rifles or this machine gun... I guess a soul rifle isn't like the best. I still want to, you know, use it and get a, get a feel for it and uh, try and figure out, you know, a use for it. Uh, but yeah, here I'm just kind of rambling on a course like I normally do. But I do want to up, update some of the more regular uh, guys that uh, check out the channel. So I guess I'm level 26. Man, I'm flying by. This levels up quite quick when I do those uh, level sevens because we do like full clears. And I mean, it's just matchmaking. I'm not even using voice communication. And I'll run around solo, or I'll come help them. I'm very strategic when I do it, so we can, you know, I collect. A, last time I had, I had the vast majority of samples. I didn't have the super samples. They only picked up two last time, that's why I got this odd number of five. Um, they only picked up two. I don't know what happened to the third one. They never picked it up, and I never got to that little stone. Uh, but anyways, I came out of there with like 20 of these and 15 of these or something like that, like collecting them all and making sure I get out and we get a lot of, a lot of clears and stuff like that anyways uh but i did want to show where i was sitting um because with the ship module i think this is kind of important because this is this is the samples i've sort of unlocked most of the stuff that i'm interested in because uh, i can just go through them here so this one um uh, was just like that starter one where you um your support weapons come with a maximum magazine so you know that's just easy enough these two here are uh decrease support weapon uh, cooldown by 10 percent, and this is decrease cooldown on backpacks strategy by 10 that uh, that's not critical at all these are gonna be like the last ones i unlock i do need to do the exploring shra exploding shra shrapnel because i never did do it it's it's just a hundred of the normal ones it just helps your orbitals and then the more guns and then i don't what's this one orbital strategy and cool yeah all three of these are good so these are going to become a priority, but not like a heavy priority. I, these aren't really needed for me, but I'm going to start aiming there. My priority was the hangar, and I did get all three of these. These are fantastic to get. This is definitely a priority. Uh, the bridge was also a priority. Uh, uh, this reduced deployment time of orbital strategy by one second. I don't, I don't know. I was comparing before and after. I don't, I don't quite get it. I won't get into it though. Nuclear radar I really wanted because of the the single. A power steering phew, that can be right near the end that's not really a thing and then uh reduce cooldown of sentry emplacement and resupply i don't even know why i grabbed this one must have been just because you know i had to grab something it's just the common ones but uh, i wouldn't rank that too high but i guess the resupplies quicker is good uh, advanced construction increases the health sentry uh so that would be okay too um yeah I, i'll be able to pick that one up soon and then ra rapid launch um you know not a priority uh, the other priority i wanted was this uh the ammo for the centuries i feel that it's required the increased 50 percent century ammo uh, for them to really be useful and i just picked it up uh so my main ones were nuclear radar these three hangers or upgrades and then this one so i've got them now so i'm not really too stressed over samples although i'm i'm, I'm still gonna pick them up I mean, when I do a solo run, I'm not too sure. I'm thinking I should just avoid samples and just try to knock out all the different objectives. Because uh, I get plenty of samples when I do a pickup group. 
uh, like in the difficulty seven. So I'm not really, I, I don't think I'm going to worry too much about samples because mediums just got common. I mean, I'll, I'll grab them, I guess, because, you know, you need lots and lots of comments. But that's where I am there. Stratagems, I've been working away at them. I only have this, I don't have the spear unlocked yet. But all of these. Uh, orbital cannons, I need to go through and grab a few more. I went and skipped and picked up the big ones because these are just kind of needed for solo play. The laser and the rail cannon strike. And then, uh, like, if you really want to try to go for it. And then Eagle Air Strike, of course, the jump pack. This one's really interesting to use with some strategies you can do. And of course, the 500 kilogram bombs. I need to get the rocket pods because apparently those are really, really good. I want to try them out. And then there's all these orbitals. I do like the orbitals. I want to play with the smoke. I want to play with some of these. Uh, Tesla Tower and the shield generator relay because I think there's a lot of a lot of things you can do. Like this would be great against the, the bots as the movie shows. And I think you know, we pop this down and then you have like your mech inside of it. You can just go crazy, right? Uh, so a lot of cool little strategies. That mech, I I've, I I looked up some strategies online, thought of my own, and I've been thinking of how to use it too. Then there's all these. I haven't played with the minefields. I mean, there's, you really got to have your mindset on some of these. Like we know when to use them and actually practice with them. Uh... The green launcher, launcher is supposed to be awesome, but I haven't unlocked it yet. The laser cannon, that's kind of cool now. Uh, the guard dog rover, one of the best builds in the game, or one of the best things to use in the game. Absolutely fantastic for, you know, uh, helping like a, a solo player uh, keep his mind on the actual game. And, well, the, the important stuff, while well, it takes care of the little guys. Uh, really good for the bugs. And then there's all the sentries. I do want to find like a use for just the basic machine gun sentry. No one likes it, but I mean, it's got to have its use. I mean, does it just last longer because it goes through ammo slower or like, like it worked great against like the basic bugs. Maybe it's only for a medium difficulty. Uh, but I still have to get the EMS motor sentry and stuff too. Uh, yeah. And then, then there's this guard dog, which I don't see how that, how, why you'd ever pick this over the, uh, the guard dog Rover. I don't, I don't get it. I should use this one of these times, though. I got the money for it. I won't try now. I don't actually know um, what kind of thing I'm doing here. Probably medium. Mm, maybe play around with the rifle. Yeah, I, I gotta think, think of the goal here. I'm kind of set up in an op uh, with... The siege upon managed democracy like level 7 suicide one, but I'm not gonna do that now, actually. While I'm here, struggle for managed democracy let me back continues. up here. We have no time to waste. Just a second. So I'm just overviewing the Galactic Mac map at this time. Uh, my videos are a little delayed, so this is kind of like a snapshot of the war, you know, a couple days before, you know, uh, before the video is up there. So I don't think there's much right now going on over here. Uh, as of this, it's just this uh, Dropnar, which we've been fighting on forever. And I don't know, it's just sitting there. These all got liberated. Nothing going on here. The creek. Is not making any progress at all, so there's not really much going on. Apparently, they're going for like a cyborg homeworld or something. We're heading towards it. Where's the? Like, is there one? Every I can't remember what it's called. Exult in the glory of at our bay. Democracy. Is it up here? Like, look at all the cool planets we still got to go to. Apparently, there's a. Like the, the there, Cyberstan. Apparently that's where the cyborgs were, and I guess there's a link between the automatons and Cyberstan. And then of course the third faction is gonna be down here and they come up with that. I mean there's so much coming to the game, it's awesome. Uh so here we are. Uh as long as I've been in the game, I mean I missed the first week and a half of the, the launch because I didn't really pick up the game yet. But basically we've been fighting on these four planets forever. I mean we were here on a Angel's Venture, it got fought back. Where's everybody hanging out? 70,000, 46,000. Everybody's hanging out here in Finnier. So we'll go back there. It's brutal though. So it's cold and it's got the meteor showers. Um, I might well go back there though. And what's happening here? So we're kicked right out of here. So this is mainly the front right now. There isn't much going on with the automatons. Everybody's kind of hanging out here. So let's go and see if we can help out here. And we're, we're gonna do medium, just for funsies. And, uh, I still can't stand those hatchery missions. Um, what do we got here? This is in the morning. But a single triumph more, 
and the operation receive and transmit vital research data oh and this is just uh, i should try this but i won't do it in this video i want to see if i can do a, a medium defend mission now because apparently they got really crazy so we'll uh we'll warp over here to this guy yeah we're gonna abandon that initiating ftl jump to the fenrir system here we go Oh, and this is uh, where we are now. What do you call it? I love the, the, the space background to it with that red uh, ringed planet. FTL jump successful. But here, see, I like all the little small Hellhouse stuff. They've, d they've done so many small touches to the game, which is uh, really cool. Like all the different players. I love watching like the solar system around it. Like when you're dropping in, all that cool stuff. Uh, so yeah, that's what we're doing. We're bringing this armor-piercing liberator. We're going with the stealth the stealth setup, I think. Actually, I haven't really considered it uh, exactly what I'm doing. So, hmm, give me a moment. Okay, I think I know what we're going to do. So it's going to be a, a strong build, like for a solo play. Uh, I just want to see if I can clear out most things on medium. I'm, I'm just trying to see here. Uh, so we gotta pick our spot. I'm gonna try to go for as much as I can. I'm not gonna worry too much about samples. Normally I've always been. Samples is what's getting me because when you take out a place, like if you watch like uh, the YouTubers do like a solo of it, they'll knock the, the place out and then keep going. Like they don't go in there to collect samples because all of them have maxed out all their sample stuff. They don't need to worry about it. So they can kind of clear everything. I have to go in and still sort of fight what's left over, right? They just sort of kind of abandon it and keep going. Uh, but we'll see, we'll see how I make out. Let's just drop over here. And then... I did pick up the stam stamina. I sort of want to try this out. Like, do you just run forever? So, okay, we're gonna try that. As of this time, we still have our free mech we can take. And then... What I'm going to do for this one... Because this is a very strong one. I'm gonna build... I'm gonna bring the guard dog rover. Because my primary... Uh, assault rifle. It's not good for cle like clearing out a lot of a lot of enemies, so this will help with that. And then, basically, since my eagles are so strong now, um, I just do the eagle build. Like, I think what I'll be doing a lot of is the five kilogram the airstrike. I might switch that out for the pods or this the strafing for the pods. The strafing's really good. I think it's I think it's underused. Um, it's pretty much instant, and it it doesn't go left to right. It goes out from you. So it's really good. But I think this standard eagle build, and then if I if I swap out like the fourth spot with something else, I can practice with it, and then I'll I'll have these. They can pretty much handle most everything, right? I mean, if you can use them well enough. So I figured I'd, I'd focus on the eagles, and then just kind of practice with whatever strategy I want to play with over here. Meanwhile, uh, switching out the, the equipment. So let's launch because I'm approaching 20 minutes of the video, and I'm. I haven't even got down to the planet. Ah, but that is how I roll. That's how I roll. Oh, good. I think I had a viewer say it's like the most boring <laughs> L-type radio request for it. And I don't disagree. I mean, if you're watching everybody else's, that's on uh, YouTube, of course. I mean, it's just a whole different thing. It's uh, way more action-packed, way more stuff going on. The scenes are cutting in and out, like all professional and stuff like that. Uh, but my channel's... My channel's about this. Rambles and appreciating the oh, small things and all that. Uh, and Let I'll just kind of keep, keep the doing the thing here. So I might actually lose this one because of uh, the uh, meteor shower. I know you can sort of get out of the way. Deploying equipment package. But, uh... Anyways. So, we're gonna get this. We're gonna go southwest. Here's the map. Elite. -E. Got one, one little nest right here. And we'll see how we do. We'll see how we do. Try to be strategic. I mean, on medium, there isn't... I mean, there's some patrols. And I, apparently they upped the patrols and upped how aggressive they were. I don't know. Uh, they certainly made it more difficult. I, but I think they're going to keep balancing it, right? Yeah, so look at the stamina working really well. Uh, so there's like a nest here, so basically, you know, you do your thing, we're gonna do the eagle strike. Whoop! This is why I have to, like, maybe use the voice recognition stuff to do it. Uh, cause I'm, I'm not great on quickly doing the arrows. Let's see what happens here. 
we didn't clear them. And they're probably gonna breach, right? Look at that. Yeah, see? That little rover, he's great. He's so strong. That's a strong buddy. Yeah, there's the breach. Freedom forever! We're gonna do this. We're gonna use our strafing run. Watch this. It goes down, and basically, one second in, there it goes. Problem is, these like hunters are they jump out of the way, right? And yeah, you're constantly reloading here. Now, this is where this assault rifle really shines on these guards because they make me mad all the time. It just breaks right through. The problem is, there's a big damage reduction, I think, uh, when going through their medium armor. Anyways, there we go. So that's that. I think I just have the uh, standard. Have a taste of democracy. Yeah, that roll is great. I love them. Just have the standard grenade. And I do have the little uh, semi-audio uh, pistol. Whoops, that didn't work. Bring it in there. How about a nice cup of liver tea? And yeah, I do agree. This is probably the best sidearm for sure. Okay, well, there's some samples right here, so we'll grab them all over here. And then... Where should we go to next? Not much around, really. Okay, there's the optional here, and a nest there. So we're gonna go this away. Oh, I suppose I should resupply. Let's I used all my grenades. Hold on a second, though. We can throw it right here while we're doing this, because there shouldn't something. be any bad guys here. I'm not actually noticing massive stamina difference, but I do in the recharge there. Oh, arc thrower, eh? Okay, let's use that. If you don't bring a support weapon, it's always fun to go down. Oh, I find, anyways, just to use whatever you find. Gives a little bit of randomness to it. All right. There's a, we'll get that later, I think. Yeah, let's go this way, see if there's anything down here. But this is where I mean, like, where medium's kind of peaceful. I mean, if you're, I've been doing a bunch of difficulty seven with a group and it's just constant, right? It, it is a, definitely a different game when you're playing with a group. Because I can go off and do my own thing, and the bugs aren't fully focused on me, and I can flank and do all sorts of these uh, strategic uh, plans and moves. Which is uh, kind of fun. Uh, I don't think the airstrike works so well on the bugs here. Attack underway. For prosperity! I mean, it closes some, it hits, right? But... The, uh, the airstrike gets sort Bears of unreliable. Whoop, there we get you. Get some! Get some! Fire in the hole! Yeah, that rover is fantastic. Can't recommend it enough just for watching your butt. And taking care of them, and it, it'll warn you too, of course, when they get close if you're not paying attention. It's a great little guy. Okay, so the little. What is this? Is this like one of those artillery guns? What's up here? Oh, it's a. Uh, okay. Little escape pod thing. That's no problem. We got some, we got a patrol up here. I mean, there's absolutely no point in taking them out. If you take them out, another one just spawns anyways and just walks the same path. The way you can do is you can just lay down, of course, and... I was playing around with, with lying down at extraction. And, yeah, they walk right up to you and... Almost have no idea if you're laying down. That's all that is here. So we'll get a couple nests. Take out that. Extractions here. Two small nests here. 
Easy peasy. So far. No meteor shower yet. Maybe they tone that down without a patch. Maybe they can change these things without doing updates. I think they can change stuff on their side. Well, obviously they can because they adjust the war or whatever, right? The droll guy or whatever. So I, I'm thinking they, they adjust this stuff without telling people. What do we have here? Oh, that's the nest there. Yeah, look at this little tiny nest. Like, you might as well have fun with it, right? <laughs> throw a... See if I... See how precision I can have with the throw here. We'll just nuke it. Let's see. Where did that land? Uh... Yeah, it's, it's kind of right down in there. I was right in front of it. <laughs> it's, a, it's always a fun thing. But it's, it has to be fairly precise. Like, I've had guy, I've had enemies standing not too far from it. I mean, if they're on a different elevation, they seem to survive it. So it can be a little disappointing, actually, that great big bomb. But I mean, for that, that's just overkill. Uh, any kind... Oh, we got patrol, which we're just going to avoid. Yeah, we'll just avoid him. I mean, absolutely no point, nothing to gain. Uh, what we can do is we can take down these guys while we're here. Faithing run. Let's line these guys up. Have a case of democracy. They're all down. It's a nice little instant thing. We got a few over here. I'm not gonna worry about being too silent. Plus the laser will just take them out anyways. Oh, here we go. Get some! Get some! Oh, was you pulling? Oh, there's the nest there. Okay. I think we got guys coming in from behind. That's all right, we'll have We'll have some action here now. Alright. Trying to hit with it while walking. I do like the gunplay. Whoops. Alright, we're gonna have to do some maneuvers this way here. Look at this guy coming with me. And I can just sit here and the laser will keep blasting away at them. It is one of the best stratagems for sure. Oh. Keepers. Alright, let's run. We gotta keep the maneuver going. We'll get another uh, draping run ready. Oh, I don't really need it. Oh, because the laser already took them all down. The rover, anyways. Alright. Oh. Oh, we found some more. Empty. Hey, you're always running out of ammo with this assault rifle. Say hello to democracy! Yeah, 30 minutes is fine. Here we got some hive guards. This will break right through. That was no problem. You got another patrol coming? Get out of here. How do we do? Oh, yeah. That was awesome. Just stood our ground. See, Look nice, out, nice relaxing difficulty for. Oh, get out of here. They always pop out. Just as you're trying to throw a grenade in there and then it bounces off their head. Comes out again. Alright, so the meteor is going to probably take me out here. Always taking me out. I was watching those, uh, they do the myth busting for, uh, Helldivers on YouTube. I think they have two episodes. They are testing to see if they were, like, tracking you. Oh, if you look up, it looks awesome. And it does look awesome. Like, what a, what a cool little game. Like, cool little thing they added there. And there's all these things they're gonna keep adding. But that's phenomenal. You can watch one come right down on top of you. <laughs> but I never even thought to look up at it. Uh, but that's cool. 
What's all the, like, sparks? Is that, like, them? I guess that's... Them, like, the rocks spawning in? Anyways. All you can do is run around and then just try to watch out where the lights are falling. I wonder if they, they probably changed that. On their end as well, right? Uh, response. This is where I want, I want that voice thing. I, I should really... Sending down equipment package. Try that again. See if I can hook that up. All right. Let's boot this sucker up. Get some democracy going here. There we go. Any patrols? Yeah. Yeah, the, the one episode I did, I said, I'm going to do a relaxing uh, medium difficulty, and it turned out to be crazy. <laughs> like, That's not relaxing at all. <laughs> This one, this one's more what I thought it would be like. And then I do have to try. Yeah, see, look at the cool planet and stuff. Ah, oh, they did such a good job. I like the small things. I get distracted easy. All right, collect the SSD drive. Oh, is this where I have to carry it? I did. I did not bring the right gun for that. Right, it is the one you have to carry. Okay, no problem. Uh, so there's a blinky up here, a nest over here. All right, I can't do... How do you drop it? Oh, I have to actually command it to drop. Or do I switch? If I switch to my gun, yeah, okay, it'll drop it there. Because I can't see my uh, stratagems. Quickest way is to switch. What do I got left? Okay, that's okay. Yeah, you really want to bring the uh, submachine gun on for this one. Here. Can I pick up stuff with it? Oh no, it's still going to make me drop it. Oh, now I'm acting weird. Oh, <laughs> oh it's the bug. <laughs> the hug bug. There we go. There, that fixed it. Animation glitch. Just make sure to drop it first, I guess. Okay. Oh, I heard some bugs. Oh, there's a patrol. Let's just lay down for a second. So I'll probably take out the nest and come back for this, because we got like 25 minutes. These guys are just gonna journey around. Oh, here, we'll, we'll bring this a little closer. I don't think they'll detect me. No. What's great about the little scout outfits? Come around here, because this is this is a crater or something? No, it's just all the purple Zerg stuff from StarCraft. Not really purple though. I'll right, we'll throw this down here. What do we got going on? Warrior. Pretty much standard stuff here. Those hunters. We'll get an airstrike way up there. Sure is. Then we'll run in because I didn't see them all. Spotted. Prepare to exterminate. Max empty. Nope. Oh. That's all right. We're there. I think this is the only one, anyways, right? Cup of yeah. Okay. Any patrols? Nope. Any samples? Guess not. All right, let's run back here. But yeah, this is far easier than what I've been doing, so it does feel more relaxing. We'll see if it keeps that way. Control, we'll turn and go around them. Where is the destination for this thing? Oh, it's going right there, right? Here, let's let's just take that there first. Get rid of this thing. So I got a five kilogram bomb and then a couple 
creating runs. Okay, so we got some. Oh, lots. Interesting. Hmm. There's a ton of ton of enemies here. So I think we'll just take them head on. It's going to breach, but we'll use the strafing run and stuff like that to uh, take them out. Is that going through the fence? Not really. Now it is. No, oh, they're, they're calling now. What we're going to do is we are going to use a kilogram bomb right on top of it almost. I guess right in front of it. Get some space. Because these guys are super annoying. There you go. You can only got five. You're annoying. Man. Jumping this Amelia. Not today! Alright. So that worked fairly well. Hate the being slowed. Whenever you're slow, jump. <laughs> Standard warriors. You get those. We're good there. We might have a patrol coming in from the south, but not too worried about that. Alright, can I put this in here? No, you gotta open the door, right? Or no? Oh, that was easy. Retrieved. And then, I've seen people shoot this out. It is kind of annoying. I don't think it does anything, though. It is really bright. Alright. So the laser, he's just doing the job by himself. So we do have people, or er, people, bugs coming in from all directions. Oops, let's use, let's use a strategy. Right here. Step into that, guys. Five kills. Behind me, eh? Oh yeah, the rover's so good. So good, the rover. Exactly. Okay. Uh, and then we gotta turn it to the left. Most of the way. Gotta turn it to its left. Oh. We still got guys coming in? Must be right on a patrol route or something. Or I think this is like, uh, when you do the evacuation, all the patrols get pulled to it. And here, we might as well use this, because then I'll, the plane will go back on its own. Yeah, that worked. All right, so it's still working away. We've got some guys to the north. I wonder what's up there. Let's just clear them out real quick. There we go. Then take that nest down. Then evacuate. Or extract, I guess. Not evacuate. Yeah, it's just the one nest? Alright. So, for this, like, mission... You know, it's certainly doable. Solo for sure for, for me. But it is a, it is a, like a strong setup. I would like to do it like a weaker setups and see if you can do it. To make sure I just keep trying to tackle difficulty four. So while we're here though, I just want to see, like, what's this about up here? I mean, is it? For prosperity! Like, is there samples or something up here? Like, what's this about? Why are we guarding this? Uh, 
know if you guys come to check it out. Get some! Get Troll some! Spawn, maybe? Oh yeah, they were right over here. What were they guarding? Nothing? Oh, meteor shower again. Here it comes. Look so awesome. It's done so well. I can just sit here and watch the whole thing. Eagle one armed and ready. Very cool. Even this looks cool in the, like into the lake. I don't know. I like the little things in the game. Oh, and we got a we got some patrols going on here. I'm gonna dodge them because it is a complete waste of time to engage the brick rolls. Oh jeez. That was a late dive, but I seen like light right on me there. Oh there's a little question mark up here. What's up here? Tactical asset near your location. Oh here we go. Alright. This I might cut out of the video just because it's like it does take a long time. Pretty much I just uh is available. Oh, I really love the sun coming down through there. That was cool. Um, yeah, I'm just gonna collect them here. Oh, looks like we're gonna have some activity. Who breached? Figured that was gonna happen. So it looks like this artillery gun is in the way of a patrol. Oh, 14 kills. That'll take care of that bug breach. Meg is always into that gun. Oh, well, there's more. Hey, look at this, eh? I think I think it's right in the way of a patrol. Maybe even two patrols. Yeah, that's why I like that grafing uh, skill so much for a stratagem. All right, I'm gonna keep collecting here. Yeah, this is crazy. I'm not sure I'm going to be able to do this because it's constant patrol right now. Did they, did they breach or no? No. Yeah, I think I've only got three here. I This is on... I'm pretty sure that's all it is. They don't really... Like, the maps don't set... I don't seem to set them to to come to these places it's just like random patrol rows that are the same that they just walk down and it just happens if they pass one of these areas and then they get drawn to it if something's happening yeah see here comes another one yeah it's pretty much non-stop so this is actually quite challenging because it's like two patrols uh that uh, keep coming here yeah see they're coming right yeah, right for it. It's just over and over again. And that's what happens as the, the match goes on. That's what seems to... Like, increase just the frequency of them. Have a taste of democracy! Hey, look at this. And we bug breached. So this is taking a long time to do just because of Democracy's on its way. How would you like to taste the freedom? And another patrol. Man. Max empty. Yeah, I'm gonna have to resupply too. This is a lot of bugs for this little side mission. Okay. How many do I have here? Oh, I gotta remember to resupply. Okay, the rover will get him. I'm sure he will. Get him, rover. 
Do I have five here yet? I have four. <laughs> yeah, resupply there. I need one more. Oh, here's one. What's this? What example. Yeah, this is taking a long time. Normally, you're not right on so many patrols. This is right on a path. Uh, where did my... Wait, where did I throw the... Oh, right here. <laughs> yeah, here they come again. Absolutely bonkers. Absolutely bonkers, yep. So I got all five here finally, so it won't take long to load them. I kind of want my eagle shaping run now. Mag's empty. Always empty. It is an always empty Get one. Some. Get some. I just want to complete the secondary objective here. Mag's empty. I get to know that vocal line well. With this gun. Okay. There's more, but at least we can get this running. At least turned on. Really glad the home smokes. Let's see more. Here. Extraction is available. Delivering payload. Bag's empty! Yeah, so this wants to be loaded now. Am I gonna be able to do that? Cover me, little rover. There. Then we can get out of here. Uh, oops, wrong way. Mm, 33 is the highest, eh? There we go. Okay. That's a patrol coming. That's mean, yeah, the patrols just pick up over time. Okay, now we can use this. Let's go this way and get away from all these patrols. Take out that last nest. We might as well use the artillery gun to do it. How am I doing with, uh... Found something? Yeah, we'll, we'll keep the eagle around. What did I find? Anything here? Oh, samples. Fire in the hole. What's in here? Nice. Come on, super bucks. Oh. I kind of want the super bucks now. Oh. Control, let's go around. Another meteor shower. Less than 10 minutes, though, so I'm going to have to... I'm gonna have to get the move on here. That took way too long, that one. And it always takes, that's always a long secondary objective. When you're solo. Extraction is available. There's something here. I, I already forgot that I had the arc thrower, too. Okay, here, let's just use this because it's fun. And you can watch it shoot. Here it comes down. I didn't seal it. <laughs> Where did it land? Look out, folks! Fire in the hole. Fire in the hole! There we go. So patrol that way. Does it tell me if I do the artillery what's coming? No, it doesn't. Okay, so there's a patrol there. I don't think I need to go down this direction, except for the blinky that's down there. Just gotta get around this patrol to get there. 
I have the mech available as well. This is going to be a long episode. Because I rambled for a good 15 minutes. Oh, well. Found something. All part of the fun. Oh, what did we get? Oh, another one. Oh, yeah. Let's keep going here. Fire keep collecting. Hole. Come on, super bucks. Only have half the samples. Metal. Oh, requisition. That's okay. I want the metals too, for sure. I wanted to see. Yeah, see through there. I might. Nothing great. Uh, he can just shoot them. Oh, here. Oh, you don't have it. Say hello to democracy! Oh, we're just gonna leave it. Just gonna leave it. Check out this shiny down here, and then I'll be it. Then we'll extract. Is this one I seen earlier? And I'm like, I'll get this one later. And now it was later. I mean, medium difficulty is just a nice, nice, fun run. Get to play with all the toys, pick out some bugs, practice your shooting and strategies. Next time I'll have to maybe attempt a not so strong setup. Like without the rover. Try something else in this place. And then what this does, is my understanding, is it just attracts all the patrols walking by. Like, it doesn't make new ones, is my understanding, like the extraction. Now, what we'll do is, just in case I need it, we'll uh, bring the suit. And I wouldn't mind some grenades. And it seems like the meteor shower has uh, sort of picked up. Like how often it's doing its thing. And I haven't actually lost a guy yet. But I might now. Look at him. Awesome. Let's get some grenades. Oh, here. We can just do this. Alright, like lay down. And as long as a meteor doesn't get me, they don't walk right on top of me. We should be fine. But I might end up them walking on top of me here. Because I got these guys coming this way. And they will be drawn here. Oh, is my laser getting them? Oh. <laughs> so much for that stealth. <laughs> oh, here. Okay. Since we're kind of swarmed. Here we go. How'd you like the taste of freedom? This is always great for extraction. I'm almost going to always want to bring one of these just for the extraction point. Like, if you if you need the samples, right? I mean, if you don't need samples, there isn't even any point in extracting, really, just for a few extra points. Yeah, that's all it was, though. Like, this has cleared them right out. Oh, come on, there. And then, here. Hillary. I think that's a napalm. Back up. Such a great addition to mix. Let's see, we got more coming. I don't know what this is. This is but you can have it. I have on the extraction zone. And still okay. Pelican one landing in progress. Oh, the Pelican guy took the move. Oh, oh. oh. No, no, oh. <laughs> it crushed the mech in me. So much for getting out of here without losing any. Deploying reinforcements. <laughs> Yeah, taken out by the pelican. Oh, now I'm three. not even in a spot where I can get there. Oh, there we go. I just need samples. Sorry, buddy. You did a good job. I mean, getting there. There we go. Extraction 
At least I think I picked up the sample. Hurrah. Today you carved another foot in a long climb to liberty. I did. There, everything, right? I think you get a small little bonus, 25%, I think. Yeah. Ten samples, two little metals. Not a whole lot with this. I mean, if you want currency, then yeah. Difficulty seven, matchmaking. I tried difficulty eight, but... Uh, the matchmaking doesn't go so well in difficulty. Everybody just pulls too much stuff. There we go. So I think that's it for that episode. Because I'm going to do the defense mission off camera, probably. 342 accuracy is only 50%. Lots of enemies killed, lots of samples collected. Yep. That's a good mission in my book. Yeah, because I can do the defense mission because now I got the extra ammo for... All the turrets and stuff. Alright, there's not much I'm going to do in here. But I think that's it for now. Uh, so that's where I'm standing in the game at this point. And yeah, looking forward to the other stuff coming to the game. And hopefully guys, you guys are spreading democracy as well. Uh, take care, see you next one.